Hey everyone, what's up? It is Evan here, and today we're gonna to be trying out and testing out some gaming PCs that we just got from a liquidation sale. Was it a bad idea or was it a really good deal? We're gonna find out. For a good number of years, my brothers, myself, and now my wife as well, have been gaming on, believe it or not, MacBooks. That's right, we have been doing our gaming on MacBook Pros. Now don't get me wrong, I love the Mac. I have used the MacBook Pro as my daily driver for a long time. It is perfect for all kinds of things from personal stuff to, to creative work like video editing. And it's also amazing that it allows you to dual boot into Windows. The problem is it struggles at any real uh, modern games with modern graphics requirements. Now recently, I got a Razer Blade, and this is an amazing gaming laptop, and I love it. And it really certainly blows the, uh, the MacBooks out of the water by far when it comes to gaming. The problem is, Naomi is stuck with, with the MacBook Pro. So we've been wanting to upgrade her, get her into something that can actually run modern games without the lag. We're not asking for much. We're not asking for 300 FPS. As long as we can get a good solid 60, we're okay with that. So our plan was to build a gaming PC so she could use that and we could be done gaming on MacBook Pros. But then I came across some pre-built PCs that were being sold in a liquidation sale and I couldn't quite pass it up. They look to be in okay condition, uh, but do they run? No idea. We're gonna find out now. Okay, here we go. As you can see, it is uh, quite damaged. We got a, uh, a keyboard and a mouse came with it. Kind of nice. I'm not expecting much, but if they function, that's fine with us. It looks to be well protected, so that is certainly a good, a good start. If you look closely here, there's, uh, there's a little bit of a bow right here where it was uh, apparently impacted here. So I'm eager to get in there and see if it actually functions okay or if there's anything damaged as a result of that. Looks like it was packaged okay. Look at that, look at that. Is this cable management? Yes, it is. I love this. They've got cable management uh, kind of hidden back here where you can't see it. So on the one side, you got the tempered glass where you can see through, see all the components, and it's well put together. All the cables that are running around are hidden behind that layer there. So that is awesome. There's a fair amount of space between the outer edge of the PC and the damage that's occurred and the, uh, the motherboard. So I think we're okay. This looks amazing, but does it perform? It came with the power cable. That's a good thing. That's, we're, we're off to a good start. Warning, please read instructions on removing the foam insert before turning on this computer. Is there a foam insert somewhere? Get this, where's my DVD drive? Most I buy power gaming PCs no longer include a DVD drive. <laughs> Nor do we want one. Okay. This was the foam panel he was talking about. That was obvious, that, that was an obvious one. Nope, did that, we're all good, so. Okay, I plugged it in, nothing happened, so that's a good sign. If I can only get the keyboard and mouse out, I give up. You know, it's not worth it, just return it. It's time to power this thing on and see if it works. Oh, ho, 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 there's that RGB lighting. Oh, and look at that, RGB accessories. Nice. Just a moment, Windows says, and just a moment we waited and waited and waited and waited. Hey, and there we have it. We are online with Windows 11. Doesn't look too bad. Now I can tell you the first thing that I'm gonna do, which is the first thing that I do on any Windows computer, is go straight into Microsoft Edge and then promptly go to chrome.com. So we can download a more superior browser and uh, cease using Microsoft Edge immediately. All right. First, let's look at our system information. All these numbers, I wonder what they mean. All right, let's jump into a game and see how well this does. And let's download Deep Rock Galactic. Okay, it is downloading, and that should give us enough time to uh, talk about our sponsor. AT&T Fiber is super fast, and now it's done, so that's all I had time to say about them. Okay, so here we are at 200 FPS. Yes. First of all, the computer is clearly functioning. It's turning on, powering up, that's great. Uh, and second of all, we are getting the performance that we are looking for. I've got Naomi here joining me for 
uh, for the second PC. It is pretty awful and I'm very hesitant to put it on my desk. Watch yeah. me hesitate. That's enough hesitation. Let's get going. In the crate there's like, I don't know, some kind of spill or something. Or molasses or something. Yeah. What is this? That um, can is I, Can I bend it? What that, happened? No, that is a... Do I listen oh, to it? Oh, don't crack it. That is a, <laughs> a, a frisbee. You get to play with it. Throw Ooh, it around. Like for kids. Yes, for yeah. kids. Yeah. Which we are not, so. Spatulas! Uh-oh. Now we're going to power on the computer. Ooh. That's exciting. The power is on. Windows is booted up here. Find my device and location. Like, you know when you accidentally leave your big honking gaming computer out in the car or on the side of the road or something oh, like no. that. Oh no, I, I, I left it. it on top of the car and it flew off on the highway. Um, so that's funny, just so you can locate your PC in case it grows legs and walks away. So this is what Naomi's been putting up with. You can see she's maxing out at 20 FPS, but when she's getting into fights and stuff, it's down to 15 or so FPS. This is terrible, 15 frames per second. This is normal to me. So that is what you've been experiencing there on the MacBook Pro. Let's switch over to the new gaming computer and see how it compares. Are you ready? Yeah, right. I'm ready. Wow. You know one thing that I love about this computer? The audio. It's amazing. The audio has nothing to do with the computer. Without looking, I want you to tell me how many FPS you think you're getting. 100? Incorrect, you're getting 200 FPS. 200? And you're being capped at 200. 206, 207. Boy, my, my knife seems to work better. I feel a lot more accurate. Wow, this is beautiful. I don't know if I've actually ever seen this stuff in the background yet. So you guys should be able to see the difference between these two. MacBook is at 20 FPS, and the gaming PC is at 220. It's 200 FPS more than the MacBook does. Mm -hmm. These graphics on the MacBook are as low as they can go. The graphics oh, on the wow. big PC. Oh wow! I just PC looked over at your screen and it looks awful. As high as can go. Yes. Okay. Right. See. Look at my oh, screen. Oh yeah. What do you think? Oh, that's awful. Now she sees it. The thing is, so I now, have no idea that now it was you that should bad probably when I just played it a minute. Exactly. Ago. So hop back on this. Oh no. No, I don't want to. Ooh, she doesn't want to give it up. Oh boy. That's what I'm talking about. Uh, it's so jittery. That's what you've been putting up with and you didn't even know it. I like that one. <laughs> the colorful, shiny one. Is it because it's colorful and shiny? No, it's because it looks amazing. <laughs> it plays so well. You're getting 12 FPS, 10 FPS, 9 FPS, 8. Stop moving. You'll get better FPS. Okay. This is horrible. This is how I've played in the past though. See, and I wonder why my eyes go goofy. Can I switch back now? <laughs> yes, you may. <laughs> Are no. you ready for this? Ready. Ready? Go, run out the door fast. <laughs> it's so smooth. Sprint. Yeah, 158. It's almost getting me up. 160, oh, 163. Haha, so <laughs> that was like perfect. I am never playing on a MacBook ever again. She's experiencing the difference, it's great. After a while I'd be like, I have to take a break because I'm getting like a headache and kind of a stomachache. And now I understand why. I did not know why before. Oh, oh no, I'm gonna be sick. I was gonna try try the same thing you're doing. Oh, oh whoa, I can't even yes, walk under the you're platform. Gonna, you will probably feel sick. One, two, three, go. And yours is already back, and mine is, look at that. Look at what, there's not even. Oh, this is so beautiful. Can we stay up till like three in the morning? No, oh, not quite that late. Oh, hey, um, got a little late last night. For some reason, I forgot to do an outro. And so, um, basically, Naomi went from an old Mac that didn't work so well for gaming to a new gaming PC that did really well at gaming. The difference was stark as you could see, as she could see, she loves it, the computers work, it's a success. That's it. Have a great one. I'm gonna go back to bed. Ugh.